holding your hand now reminds me when we were in Iceland and we had only really known each other for a few weeks and we just had a really awesome day just out exploring and we were driving back to our Airbnb and you would fall asleep in the front seat and I was holding your hand and I know at that moment I was going to spend the rest of my life with you because <laughs> you felt like home. Every day, Brittany, you amaze me. She has quietly and effortlessly slipped into our hearts and our unconventional and crazy life. I'm not saying you're crazy, but it does take a special person to fit into our life, right? Oh Who would have thought, literally hours after we attended a painting class, turned surprise strip tease? you would be meeting the man you're marrying here today. <laughs> I mean, who knows, if it wasn't for that one random night, you two might have missed out on a lifetime of happiness. He's always seeked excitement. He's always seeked um, knowledge. He's always been a big dreamer, always been a big dreamer. The project we're doing right now is because of him dreaming big. He's not only a great son, he's a great friend. As I watch you and Jordan together, whether it be cooking in the kitchen, working on your renovations, or working side by side, you, the two of you, it's, it's just meant to be. Oh, you're so beautiful. <laughs> I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I, Jordan, take you, Brittany, as my wife. I, Brittany, take you, Jordan, as my husband. And vow to be faithful to you, honest with you, and worthy of your trust and heart. Through the joys and sorrows that we will experience, I will love and honor you all the days of my life. I'm just trying to hold on. I've watched for almost five years and observed from a distance everything that they do and are. They're hardworking, kind, understanding people, and I'm so grateful that Brittany's found someone like Jordan. Watching them laugh, poke fun, talk, do belly to belly, and learn from each other helps me to understand the kind of person I need to marry. It all feels so surreal, but the day is finally here. Welcome to the family, Jordan. We're more than happy to have you. Your goofy, smart, caring, peculiar, and quirky, quirky self. I cherish the relationship we have, and I look forward to that continuing to grow. You treat each other with respect and kindness and compassion. Jordan, I thank you for giving us such a kind and loving daughter-in-law. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I'll go on adventures. You've taught me what love really is. You're patient. You're so kind. You forgive me when I mess up. Love you guys to death, Jordan. Proud to call you my son. Looking forward to the the journey forward. Looking forward to tormenting your kids as you tormented mom and I. So may God's blessings be on your wedding, and congratulations. I love you both.